Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedi again. Today we're going to keep working on our Pro Tools video tutorials. Uh, we're going to be demonstrating the use of the last edit tool, which is the Smart Tool. Well, the Smart Tool is, I guess you could say it's the holy grail of editing tools, of, of edit tools. Why? Because it, it contains, or it lets you operate as if you had three tools at the same time. Um, these three tools are the trim, the selector, and the grabber tool. We, you know, we explained in the past that you could uh, engage your trim tool by simply clicking on that trim and then doing your trimming or your selector tool and making your selection or clicking on that grabber tool and grabbing uh, the clips. Now, what if you want to have all three selected at the same time? Well, in that case, you need the smart tool. Now, there's no more icons here, right, for for edit tools. Well, the smart tool you select by clicking on this little rectangular box here. If you click there, boom, it all goes blue telling you that now you're in smart tool, meaning that you can use the trim tool, the selector tool, and the grabber tool. And how do you select them? Or how do you choose which one you're going to be using? Well, you do that by the way you hover your mouse on top of your clip, by where you actually place your mouse. So start with the trimming um, functions of the smart tool. Very simple. If you go to either the left or the right end, or the, the start or the end of the clip, you're going to see that that bracket appears. Once the bracket appears, that's telling you right there that you're in trim. So you simply just click and drag and you'll be trimming. Same with the left part. Once you see that left bracket, you can click and drag. Easy peasy. Now, what if we're going to do fades? Well, same thing. You go to the end or to the start, but you go to the top. And as soon as you go to the top, you see that square happens. It's not the bracket anymore. It's actually square, meaning that now you can click and drag to create your fades. Okay. Once again, cool. you can see there. Actually, there's already a fade here. So, if I just hover on top of the top left corner, you can see that square there, so you click and drag, and there is your fade. Okay? Now, um, that's as far as the trimming. Now, what about the selector tool? Well, very simple. In order to select it, you can simply, or in order to use the selector tool function of the smart tool, you simply hover the mouse anywhere within the clip that's not on the sides, anywhere from the middle up. Okay, from the middle up, you can see the cursor looks like the um, selector. So anywhere from the middle up, you can see that selector cursor. So you simply click and drag to select. Once it's selected, you can delete things, you can copy things and then place them somewhere else by pasting. So you'll be using the selector function. Now, last but not least, the grabber function of the smart tool, just as we did with the selector, if you hover the mouse anywhere within the clip that it's not to the sides, anywhere but, uh, but it has to be middle and down. Middle, so center and below, you can see that hand cursor telling you you're in grabber mode, so you can simply click and drag. So you'll be grabbing that file. So once again, Middle below, that's grab. Middle and above, selector, sites, um, sites, trimming, and then sites, top, fades. That's it. That's your smart tool. You should be using the smart tool 99% of the time. Um, it's the smart thing to do. Okay, so actually by default, Pro Tools comes with the smart tool um, engaged. So. That's that's it. That's the smart tool in Pro Tools. If you have any other questions, please call us from Obedient PC Audio Labs and we will be happy to help you. We will see you guys soon. Bye-bye. Want to learn how to produce music using this or using that or using all of these? Have you been watching videos, reading manuals, blogs, and trying to figure out everything that it takes to be a music producer? Do you have a bunch of music gear that you purchased and you still haven't made any music? Well then you need Obedia, the world's only one-on-one -on -one digital audio training and tech support service. Check out the link below for a special new subscriber offer.